February 17th, a Thursday. It's about 10.30 right now. I woke up at nine o'clock today because I slept in after some statics homework that kept me up till three in the morning. Um, but now I'm on my way to school and I will show you what goes on throughout my day. Here's the engineering building, the new one. So I used to take this route at the beginning of the first semester, last semester, and in the fall. But I stopped because of this. This hill, it's crazy. I actually biked up it for like the first week of school, but afterwards, now I just don't have it. Now, I didn't, I don't even know what this is, but apparently today's, or sometime soon is Giving Day, which is this tradition I do with. And it looks like they have a whole set of some things to do here for getting it. I'll probably check it out later. Okay, and now I'm at Weil Hall um, for my office hours for ASCE, the American Society of Civil Engineers, um, which are every Monday and Thursday. And for my Thursday one, it's the block from um, 10.40 to 11.25. So I'm on my way there now. So yeah, that's the ASCE office here. And then we also actually have a lounge. I'll show you in here as well. So one of my officer positions is office manager. So I actually, um, earlier this week, I got all this food for the office here, and yeah, we just got some some cool stuff going on here, and we still have some hearts from Valentine's Day, which was this Monday. And then yeah, also we also have a cornhole tournament coming up next Friday. Um, if you are interested, totally join our group me, and then you will be able to keep updated and set yourself up with a carpool if you need it for the event. It's a great networking experience, especially if you are a civil or environmental engineer. All right, so we just got some Krishna here and I'm here with some noses. Oh. Hey. Not him, but I think he's, he's gonna do it next semester. I'll do it, I'll do it, I swear. Yeah. <laughs> We have our video. Not you. Alright, now it's time for the next class, which is statics. Okay, so we finished statics and we just came from Broward Dining Hall for some lunch. And the wind went around here with David and Michael. Okay, we're at the rights union now. Who will win? All right, so this next part was a little bit unexpected, but while we were at the rights union, we ended up talking with some members of both the Gator Party and the Change Party. And for those of you who might not know, these are the two main parties running in our election coming up for student government and voting is actually next week so they're all out tabling at the rights union and i'm sure other places on campus firstly this channel is not really affiliated with either party one of the main goals of this channel is to highlight all the different things going on at the university of florida in real time and when i was walking by um the tabling here it seemed like the election which is kind of a whole university-wide event uh, would be kind of a big thing to include. Um, so I figured it would be a good record of the student culture to um, include this kind of information. So we wanted to just go out and explore and see what each party wanted to say um, about their um, policies that they're gonna bring from forth for the next student government year. And so, we ended up talking and interviewing with Change Party a little bit, 
um, as you'll see now. All right, so we were walking by the rights union and we are here with um, the change party. Hi. So what are your names? My name is Dayana Day Peak. My name is Kenya Warner. Okay, and then you both are running the election, aren't you? Yes, okay. uh, I'm running for student body treasurer. And I'm running for student body vice president. Awesome, is there anything you want to say to the viewers? that change party or anything that you're um well for? change party we stand on social justice representation and equity and our whole purpose is just to get as much transparency out there and make our our campus a more equitable place for all the all the student body and um, elections are on the 22nd and 23rd so if you're a uf student come out and vote all you need is your gator one card and you're good and then unfortunately gator party was not comfortable with us putting them on this channel However, if you are interested in, in learning more about them or the change party, we have some links below that I thought I'd just include um, in the description. Okay, and now back to the vlog. Who writes in that one? Yeah, it's like a right eye and a right eye, but it's like a right and a left eye. The SACE intern meeting ended an hour in Marston. <laughs> Here's Ryan and other people. <laughs> what is your major? Well, there, buddy. That's a lot of information. <laughs> is studying for Orgo. And <laughs> I'm not sure what she's doing, but also studying for Orgo. When is the Orgo exam? It's tomorrow. What would you like to know? All right, so it's 9.30 now, and I'm heading to the rights union from uh, Marston to get my bike to go down to Broward. Dude, no! Are you kidding me? Just Eddie. Okay, and that was my day. Um, it was pretty eventful, for sure. Lots of unexpected things happened, and we got to see a lot of people, so, which was really cool. But anyways, that'll be the end of this vlog. Hope you all enjoyed. Stay tuned for the next vlog, which should be coming out soon. And until then, thank you for watching. Also, if you're watching this video on the day it comes out, you should totally consider going to Casa's Chinese New Year show. I'm playing an emperor in the skit, and it'll be a lot of fun. Oh, sorry. I'll redo it. <laughs>